Lesson number one, the Nissan Leaf does not have a good place to put your camera. Coming up the voice, talkie talkie talkie. <sighs> Nissan Leaf does not have autopilot. I would like autopilot, especially in the mornings, all the commuting we have to do. Mm -hmm. Trying to drink water would be nice with an autopilot. Having an autopilot would be nice when you're trying to drink water. You get a snack when you're starving. First world definition of starving. Let's say your typical hatchback sedan gets 25 miles per gallon. So the Nissan Leaf is a car with a three gallon gas tank. You say, Callie, I would never drive my car with three gallons in the, in the gas tank. And you're right, you wouldn't, for very good reason. A gas car does not have very good instrumentation so you don't really know how much gas you've got in your car, at least not in a way that you could trust it, right? You wouldn't trust to know I've got exactly two gallons, or I've got exactly one and a half gallon, or I've got exactly a half gallon of gas in your car. So what the thing about electric cars is that the instrumentation is way, way better. So when we're talking about I've only got three gallons of gas, I know very accurately I have three gallons, or I have two and a half gallons, or I have two and a quarter gallons, or I have a half gallon left. So that I know exactly how much uh, energy I have left and how many miles I can, I can likely get from that energy. My, my uh, energy consumption based off of my driving patterns is going to be much more consistent than it is for gas. And you'll certainly learn the types of things uh, very quickly over time. You'll learn the kinds of driving uh, habits that you'll have that will use a lot or a little bit of electricity. So what I find being I said 25 miles per gallon three gallon tank so this car will very often get 75 miles on a full charge uh, without any worry whatsoever and that's that's with a mix of highway and city driving car, electric cars are sort of the opposite of gas cars in that a gas car when we talk about the miles per gallon of a gas car you typically have a lower number for city driving and you have a higher number for highway driving well electric cars are flipped they use more electricity to go fast, and they use very little electricity when you're just driving around the city going very slow. It turns out that most of your energy is actually consumed pushing the wind out of the way uh, when you're going fast on the highway. This channel is gonna focus on starting a business in the electric vehicle market. We're gonna talk about electric cars, electric car infrastructure, and specific emphasis on the electric vehicle experience in St. Louis, Missouri.